and welcome to another episode of Monday Musings. So last week we just celebrated Thanksgiving and that ushers us into the holiday season. And uh, for this holiday season, I just have two things to say to you. So first thing I would say is, as you're celebrating, be responsible. Uh, well, what, does, what do I mean by that? So usually what happens when we are extremely happy or on the other hand, when we are sad or upset about something, we tend to forget about our goals. We tend to forget about our responsibilities. So if you have set some goals before you, do not forget about those goals as you're celebrating. For example, if you are on a uh, path to reduce your debt, then don't go out and overspend to the extent where uh, your year ends in a way where you did not make a net progress in reducing your debt. Uh, yes, I understand for Christmas, for Thanksgiving, for Hanukkah, for whatever uh, you celebrate, there might be some reason to overspend in December, and that would be fine, but just don't overspend to the extent where all the progress that you made through the year uh, gets canceled out, and then you end the year either with net zero or you end the year with a net burden uh, increase. If you're a student, uh, don't let the festivities take your target away uh, from making sure that you're making progress towards uh, passing your classes or graduating or whatever it is. So keep make sure that you keep doing what you need to do. Make your responsibilities your priority as you are celebrating. Also, as you're celebrating, uh, don't don't forget what other responsibilities you have. So if, if you've been going seeing uh, an elderly parent or somebody in the family on a regular basis, don't forget them. And, and all of that can be summed up in just two words, celebrate responsibly. Do not uh, take your eyes off of the uh, things that uh, need to be taken care of. Okay? Make sure that you're meeting your financial goals. Make sure that you're meeting your educational goals. Make sure that you are meeting your other obligations and responsibilities. So as you celebrate, uh, do not forget about your responsibilities. The second thing I want to say about uh, uh, festivities and celebration is that there are people among us uh, who are perfectly happy if you just let them be. So for example, uh, you are at a party uh, and you are trying to do karaoke. And if there's one person in there who's just happy to be there, be in the moment, enjoy seeing everybody else uh, participate and perform, uh, and don't force that person to do something against his or her will. If, if that person is perfectly happy and enjoying everybody else doing it, just, just leave that person alone, let them be. Uh, everybody does not celebrate the same way. Everybody does not express their happiness the same way. So in, in this moment of celebration, in this time of uh, accepting the end of the year in a happy way, let's, let's just remember that uh, we need to be uh, responsible. And secondly, do not force your way of celebrating on somebody who may not uh, be celebrating in that same way. So be, uh, be uh, conscious of how some people may be different in the way that they experience and express happiness. So if you like what I say in these videos, please uh, subscribe to my channel, uh, share these videos on your social media. If you're watching me on Facebook, it takes very little to just hit share. So please do that and uh, <clears throat> make sure that you subscribe to the channel as well. So have a great week, happy Monday to you, and I will see you next Monday. Take care.